fallout continues after President Trump was implicated in federal court by his longtime and now former attorney. Yeah, Fox News correspondent Ray Bogan has updates from Washington. President Trump's supporters have shown fierce loyalty even through scandals. But now the president is facing new legal troubles in what critics call the worst week of his administration. The president has done nothing wrong. The White House on the offensive, engulfed in controversy after Monday's twin convictions. Paul Manafort, who once chaired Trump's campaign, found guilty of fraud. The president's old fixer, Michael Cohen, pleaded guilty to federal felony charges. Just because Michael Cohen uh, made a plea deal doesn't mean that that implicates the president on anything. In court, Cohen admitted to breaking the law and says then-candidate Trump ordered him to pay hush money to two women, Stormy Daniels and Karen McDougal. If Michael Cohen, with the prosecutors in New York agreeing, admitted to that, then certainly Donald Trump is guilty of the same crime. The president has acknowledged the payment, but says it didn't come from any campaign accounts. But they didn't come out of campaign. In fact, my first question when I heard about it was, did they come out of the campaign? Because that could be a little dicey. Mr. Trump also tweeting his disdain for Cohen while expressing sympathy for Manafort, leading to questions about a possible pardon. The president certainly seems to be planting the idea that he'd be open to a pardon. That's a big deal.